Hello, it's Eve. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have three botanical slash nature journals that I want to share with you. Um, I made the covers with a technique that I found on YouTube and it's called the four letter technique. So this is basically um, craft paper or craft cardstock that um, you alter that it looks like a full letter or it looks like leather and so I had so much fun that I made three of them so these are the covers um, this one I embossed and then just um, put on some, uh, how's it called, distress ink and I added the metal book corners so I have two of the embossed ones and one I left blank because I also like the effect of the just a kind of crinkled uh, leather effect and so yeah so um, they are basically the same on the inside, just um, of course the, the pockets and, and stuff uh, rise a little bit, but I will show you one. So on the front we have a pocket with a tag, it says this book belongs to and a little stamp here. And here I did some sewing and a little collage. Some stamping here, coffee dyed paper, a little stenciling, the lace here. This is a page from a vintage uh, garden book. Then I made a pocket out of wallpaper, and in here is a vintage postcard or greeting card and it's got some writing on it and this is just a piece of vintage uh, stationery for journaling space Sticks in here this is also uh, vintage stationery paper this is some pink lace, then I have a page from Edith Holden in German. Here we got an envelope. I made this altered paper clip with a little charm on it. Looks like this. And then there's an envelope that I decoupaged and did some stamping, added a vintage stamp here. And the envelope itself is vintage, so it's beautiful with this lining here. So this goes right here. And then the paper clip. Just like this. Page from a vintage magazine from 1906 with um, advertisements. Here I made a fabric pocket and a little journaling card with a stamp and some stenciling on the back. Another page of vintage stationery. Little tuck spot with a journaling card. Some stamping, a little vintage uh, fabric this is I got this from someone who made uh, doll clothes and um, yeah I really love it this is a vintage uh, rose picture out from a book vintage dictionary page A 
and in the middle of the signature we got two tuck spots and in here I have a playing card that I altered and distressed a little bit and a tag with this mason jar and some eyelash trim and here's just a piece of note paper with this beautiful rose and some butterflies on the string here then here is another envelope that I made with another altered paper clip with this charm this is the envelope I made did some sewing and just a little collage here and inside here is a vintage greeting card that is blank. So this goes right here. Back on. Coffee dyed paper here. And here is a fabric pocket that I sewed on and a tag that I made. This one says do small things with great love. Other side of the Edith Holden. This is a vintage applique that I sewed on here. other side of the wallpaper pocket and in here is another envelope this is a vintage envelope and in here is just a journaling card place here and then on the back cover another tuck spot with a Tim Holtz child here and another journaling card so yeah this is what they look like as I said they are all pretty much the same um, except of of course the front pockets and also the the envelopes are a little different and the back pockets of course it's but basically they are um, the same the same composition and um, same papers that I've used and yeah if you are interested I will list them in my Etsy which um, I will link my shop down below and yeah I hope you like it and I wish you a wonderful day see you next time bye bye